Hey guys, it's me, Izzy, and I'm here for part two of the rescuing of the chipmunk. The video that you're going to see is us releasing Rhodey into the wild again. You will not see her on camera because she's actually in a little towel. And yeah, go check out the video. And it's gonna play right now. Okay. We'll let nature do it. Okay, okay. Okay, calm down, Miss Put it under the we'll come back. That video that you just saw, let me explain it. So, the footage that you saw and what that man was carrying, my second cousin's boyfriend, he was carrying the little chipmunk. What, the, we, what we thought was the best thing to do, and like I, I don't know anything about this, okay? Like I didn't know how to deal with it. Um, but what we did was we left it next to a tree, and we could still see that I was breathing, and that it's like eyes were open, but it was just like staying still. And so we just laid it there, and then we just we just walked away because I was gonna st I was gonna like start crying. I didn't know if Rody was gonna survive or not, and I couldn't take a video of it. But my my second cousin's BF said that he saw it walk into the forest, and that we were going to suppose supposedly check on it and uh, on the next day and this all happened like a long time ago but uh i wasn't able to upload it until today we don't know if Rody homer is still alive but for the most part all i know is that Rody homer walked into the forest and that that's the end of the story we don't really know how it ends for Rody homer but for us, we know that she re was she was returned to her home. That is something I am pretty proud of because at least we know that we returned her and we didn't kill her. And she's probably out there still walking around doing her own little thing. And I I hope nobody ever does that again and just leaves the animal on the road to die. If you see an animal on the ground that you know is dying, the least you could do is help it out. And if you leave it there, then it's partially your fault for it dying if it dies because you didn't help it. Sorry, I'm not, I'm not trying to like gain on you or anything. But yeah, that's how I viewed it when I picked her up and I'm just like, and I'm kind of happy I did because the people who were like at the front office, at the vet, they told me that if I left her there on that road in the middle of the trail, it was a for sure she was going to die. I was kind of happy that they told me that and see her walk into the forest so yeah Rody, if you're out there if you're out there i want to say i'm sorry if i did anything wrong and i hope you have a great rest of your life and goodbye see you later and also i miss you